The cases of children being prosecuted for truancy in Platte County School District continue moving forward. The superintendent says it's part of an effort to crack down on truancy, but parents were angry at a school board meeting this week. News 13's Rachel Sebastian was there. They're treating them like they've been put on felony charges. Platte County School Board holds a meeting in Chugwater to discuss, among other things, the truancy cases in the district. Many parents of the kids who were served the truancy papers in early June attend the meeting Monday night and voice their concerns. When I was explaining the situation with my children, the part of the board members were just up there shaking their head and closing their eyes in disgust. School board members News 13 contacted did not wish to comment on the issue. Children as young as nine are accused of the charge. Our kids are not yet on probation, but we're waiting to hear when our court date's going to be. Looking personally at these cases, I am shocked. A guilty charge, in addition to probation and drug tests, means no guns in the home. And that's certainly concerning, and it should be concerning now. And the kids will miss you know, This is a gun state. This is a state where there's a lot of gun ownership. They're having to go for the urinalysis test. They're having to do these things that they don't have a clue what all these different things are. The Housers want all families under the charge to speak up and seek help. We have an attorney now, and we are taking it as far as we need to take it in order to get it to where we won't be going through what some of these other parents are going through. Rachel Sebastian, News 13, Platte County. Some parents say they're considering moving their children from the district. In the meantime, they hope the prosecutor will drop the charges.